he promised you the world, but something just doesn't feel right. <laughs> My name is Greta Berishita. I'm dating and relationship coach for women. For the awesome high value woman secrets, subscribe to my channel and hit the bell to be notified when I upload new videos every Wednesday and Sunday. And just before I share with you the three key reasons why men make promises, don't forget to take my self-awareness test. Are you a woman of low value or, or high value? which I will drop down in the video description box below. So let's start. Number one is promises through flattery and future. There is nothing wrong with a man giving you a lot of flattery and promises. And if he is giving you flattery and promises, he is charming you. It means he's attracted to you. He is interested in you. He feels the chemistry. Therefore, he wants to promise you the world and make you feel amazing. I would compare flattery and promises to a light version of a man serenading to you. I mean, it's a bit of kind of low investment light version, but it's still something similar to that. It's like a beautiful poem. We all enjoy it. But the main key here is not to be naive and gullible, but to be wise. If you choose to be naive and fall into his trap, like sleep with him way too soon or actually think that he fell in love with you from the moment he had seen you, and you're gonna be jumping up and down in your mind and because of that you will decide to give your whole self to him in the first few days, weeks or months, most likely he'll be gone in no time. He will feel that you're way too easy. So ladies, be wise. Men do not fall in love at first sight as they are smart. I would say don't underestimate men. Overestimate them instead. Because it's them who are coming with strategies on how to seduce women. And if him falling in love at first sight with you was true, he would fall in love literally with every single female he met that was attractive. Men fall in love with spending quality time with a woman and the only way to keep a charmer is to behave correctly, which is being smart being high value, setting proper boundaries, respecting yourself, loving yourself, taking the relationship step by step and observing his behavior. Ladies, let him charm you and enjoy it as it's a natural and wonderful feeling. As long as you understand it is to charm you and impress you for you to like him, and show you his best cards. Please watch my video right here, how to be a high value woman if you want to keep this charmer interested. Then number two, he makes promises to keep you around, to drag you along for as long as he can. Guys want to squeeze as much as we can out of you. Not all guys, but many of them. So if you are in a relationship with a guy for one, two or three years and he has not given you full commitment and there is nothing official happening, I mean engagement or marriage, it's because he is dragging it out. He might have told you that he really wants to marry you, have plenty of kids, is talking about getting the house together. He says what he knows you want to hear in the moment to buy some time. But as the time passes, he will start mentioning things such as before committing, first I want to move in and then he'll want to start a business with you and then have a baby. And if you agree to all this first before marriage, for example, 
few years down the line you will be moved in together pregnant with a business to share and you will start saying things such as mm, i think i might have some commitment issues where will you go then you are trapped so what do you do not to fall in such a situation I would really recommend to have a time frame for yourself. He doesn't need to know about it. If one, two, three years down the line, the relationship is not growing and you have been really high value, really the best version of yourself, then you have nothing else to do but let it go as he simply does not deserve you. A high value woman is a rare diamond. If he is not seeing that or is assuming that every woman is like that and there is way more fish in the sea, let it go as he is simply not worthy of you. If he doesn't see your value and doesn't appreciate you for who you are, ladies, Keep your self-dignity and let him go. The relationship, same as everything in life, needs to grow and flow in order to be happy and fulfilling. Otherwise, it becomes like still water, which is not moving. It gets stagnant, dirty, filthy, and it starts to stink. Number three, promises that he will start to change. If you have been dating a guy and you have been on the low value side, which is losing emotional control, arguing, please watch my video, what is a woman of low value right here. It is natural that your guy has been taking you for granted and not treating you well because you were acting immature and not valuing or respecting yourself. If you broke up with this guy and he now wants you back, you can take him back and test him to see how things will go. And if you are now applying high value to your behavior, which is again being mature, wise, in control of your emotions, understanding the differences between men and women. If you're not sure, are you high value or low value? As I said before, you can take my free self-awareness test, which is linked down in my video description box below. You can see how much the relationship is improving because a guy will only change how he treats you only when you will change on how you treat yourself and others. So if you'll value yourself, if you'll respect yourself, he will start to value and respect you too. But however, if you already have a high value behavior from the start, you are a busy woman going for your dreams and goals, you take care of yourself, you go to the gym, you set boundaries, and he is doing nothing with his life, he is partying, he's lazy, plays a million of manipulative games, he has no goals, no dreams, no ambitions, and he lacks emotional control and you choose to break up with him as that's just not good enough. He then begs you back after a couple of months. He promises that he will change. Well, it will not happen. Why? because it's impossible for anyone to make solid changes in their lives in just a few weeks or months. Change is a long-term process. It can take years if you're serious about your own change, self-improvement, for example, and it can take many, many years if you just grow as you go along. And a lot of people don't even think they need to grow or change for the better. So that type of person is, we can pray for them. So if you want to take him back, my suggestion is to take step by step test him, date him, monitor his behavior. You can still give him a chance, but be wise, observe and take your time. Then make the decision. 
So ladies, if you like my video, please press like. Let me know below in the comments of what did you think. Join Greta's High Value Woman School where we are all in the same boat, learning how to be a woman of high value and bring out the best in your man. Follow me on my Instagram. My Instagram is private. It's called Ladies Relationship Coach. And for one-on-one -on -one coaching, coaching with a member of my team, or if you would like to buy some of my video packages, such as how to stay attractive via text, games men play with women, how to control your emotions, and how to get your ex back, check out my website, which is called ladiesrelationshipcoach.com. And that's it. <laughs> So ladies, thank you for watching. Have a beautiful day. Kisses from Manchester. Mm.